Hello there guys, what's up, this is Chris, and welcome back to another Modern Warfare 3 commentary. Uh, today what I have for you is a 30 and 4, a regular team deathmatch on the map Arcaden. Now, I'm going to run in these perks, sleight of hand, quick draw, and stalker. We're running in the proficiency attachments, uh, using the silencer and rapid fire. Now, this does turn out to be a really, really en entertaining game. Uh, going 30 and 4 in a regular team deathmatch. It's not bad. Uh, I really think that's a pretty decent gameplay. Uh, it's rushing, it's entertaining, so I really, really, really do hope you enjoy it. But that's not what I've really made this commentary for, so I'm just going to let the gameplay run in the background and move on to what I want to be talking about with you guys today. Now, this would be something that's been on just about every single commentator's mind for the last three or maybe possibly four months now, uh, ever since these acts were introduced. Now, you're probably wondering, what you know, what is he on about? Because people outside of the commentating sort of scene have not really been told about this sort of thing or have not really took much interest in it. Uh, now, this would be the Stop Online Piracy Act and the Protect IP Act, shortened to SOPA and PIPA. Now, for the gaming industry, uh, the Protect IP Act doesn't really have that much of an influence, so during this commentary, I'm really going to just focus more on gaming and sort of ignore the P Protect IP Act. Um, okay, so what SOPA sort of threatens is the freedom of speech on the internet, effectively. Uh, they're going to be a lot more tighter restraints on what is copyrighted material, and the, the sort of the threat to the commentating scene is that we can't use sort of any com uh, copyrighted material. Uh, it's already very, very stringent about what we can use, such as why I use certain music and don't use music by the Warner Group or the Sony Entertainment Group, because I'll get strikes. Um, if this act was to pass, that means I can't use any music barely whatsoever. Um, and also, it, it, it depends on sort of the legislation that they apply, but it may put a, a stop to commentating altogether, as Call of Duty is the property, effectively, of Activision, and it, it's still copyrighted material, and it's, it's questionable whether we would actually be allowed to post it still. Um, so, in, basically... Um, Against this act, there's been multiple people. Now, one of them would be Wikipedia, because Wikipedia does own a lot of material on its site. Uh, however, it does use some copyrighted material, um, so therefore this act really does threaten their existence. Um, hence why they staged a blackout on Wednesday. Uh, now, that was a 24-hour protest against the SOPA and PIPA acts. Um, during that time, I think about 170 million people saw the message, and the congressmen and women of America were absolutely flooded with emails basically saying, stop this act, we don't want it, let's get rid of it. Um, so, you know, it, it was a good success, like, they got to give them that. Um, so, Wikipedia is now back online again, but in recent uh, events, the American government has now closed the internet file sharing site, Mega Upload. Now, this isn't actually anything sort of really related to SOPA and PIPA, but it's in the same way. It's the sort of thing that will be happening a lot more often if these acts were to pass, uh, as the, the sites like that do hold a lot of copyrighted material. Um, you know, it's just one of those things. So, in basic... <laughs> In retaliation, should we say, for the US government closing this, the Internet Hacking Organization, or should we say Internet Hacking Group, Anonymous, uh, thought back, should we say. Um, now, if you don't know who Anonymous are, they were basically the guys who were responsible for the PlayStation Network going down a few months back. I'm not entirely sure how long ago it was, but uh, if, if you can remember, there was no chance that network was going back online. They just had it on a switch. If they wanted to back up, back up they could. Um, now, with Xbox being completely uh, against SOPA, the chance of them hacking Xbox is very, very slim. So, But PlayStation, once again, has supported the act. Not clever. But anyway, I was talking about Anonymous, so I'm going to get back onto them. They've actually gone and closed uh, by flooding the, their servers. They've gone and closed down about uh, four, or f four or five, maybe six uh, government websites in the US, including the FBI, um, what was it? The FBI, the Copyright Institution of America, 
Uh, there's, there's loads of them. If you want to, don't have a look, just Google it because there's so many places they've just flooded and closed down effectively, just closed their websites down in, in protest. Um, I think their statement for the day was Wednesday's blackouts were voluntary, now the, now the government will face our blackouts or something along those lines. Just follow Anonymous on Twitter and you can basically see all that. Um, but the, basically the latest news is that hopefully these acts will now be opposed. Uh, I'll actually carry on talking about this a little bit more in the next commentary as I have pretty much run out of time. But it's looking good. Uh, these acts have actually been postponed now so it's going to be pending further investigation. Uh, but we shall see. Hopefully gaming will continue on the internet and I shall hopefully keep bringing you some awesome content. Until next video guys, I shall see you soon. Thanks a lot for watching. Here we go!